One of the neat things about the 40 Day Joy Challenge is that if you get started and you get off track, um, you don't need to stress out about it. Um, you just pick back up where you left off and go at the same pace as you were previously going. Now, I don't want anybody to get off track. There, there's some, some power, some mystery of, of, of really how valuable this is when you, if you were able to do 40 straight days. But let's say something happens, you get thrown off track. First thing is, no stress about it at all. Pick right back up where you left off. Don't try to catch up or double up on a day or two. Don't want you to do that. I just want you to proceed at the normal, reasonable daily pace of one day per time. And if you do that, you'll get the measurable results that we're looking for, even if you skip a day or two. But if you can, carve out nine minutes every day, preferably nine minutes that you previously would have been sleeping, let's say, nine minutes that you previously would have been having lunch, nine minutes that you previously would have been watching TV. Just carve out nine minutes and you'll get the program done. And make it make an appointment in your calendar, actually. You know, put it in your, your iPhone, put it in Outlook, put it in whatever medium you're using to track how you use your time.